Welcome back to Electric TV. As always, I'm your host, Dominic Giratano. On this program, we highlight the very best in electrical construction. Complex projects built by the Powering America team of NECA and the IBEW. The city of Detroit is in the middle of a renaissance, transforming into an example of what a modern metropolitan area can be. At the center of this rebirth is the District Detroit and Little Caesars Arena, a 50-block footprint connecting downtown to midtown, connecting the past to the present, and reimagining what Detroit once was and what it can be again. This return to excellence is in part being fueled by the NECA IBEW team in one very special code of ethics. During its heyday, Detroit was a symbol of American economic might. But with the downturn in the economy and dramatic changes in the auto industry, Detroit experienced a massive exodus that left the city in a state of disrepair. In recent years, just like most other places, Detroit's economy has improved. But as it did, questions arose on how to revitalize downtown to bring people back to the city. In 2014, Illich Holdings and Olympia Development of Michigan unveiled its vision to do just that. The District Detroit, a dynamic mix of residential, office, and retail space anchored by six world-class sports and entertainment venues, including Little Caesars Arena, the new home of the Detroit Red Wings and Detroit Pistons, was that vision. The District Detroit is about a 50 block project in downtown Detroit, connects downtown to midtown and it surrounds an incredible group of entertainment assets, theaters, this new Little Caesars Arena in which we're standing right now, incredible places for people to visit. Once completed, the District Detroit will be one of the largest sports and entertainment developments in the country. This mixed use development combines five neighborhoods into a walkable destination for people who want to live, work, and play in an exciting urban environment. And with the construction of Little Caesars Arena and the surrounding district expected to generate at least $1.8 billion in total economic impact, Illich Holdings knew that the only way to bring this project to life would be with the finest craftsmen and women in the world. This project, the District Detroit, is immense in its vision and scope. It's the largest sports and entertainment district of its kind in the country. Something that ambitious, that audacious, requires a highly skilled, highly dedicated, highly competent workforce. And that's what we've found in our work with the trades. The Powering America team of NECA contractor Motor City Electric and IBEW Local 58 not only could provide the skilled labor needed for the job, but they were willing to put their commitment in writing with the code of excellence. This job was just starting off the ground, so we had the conversation and this would be the first one that was gonna roll out the new construction code of excellence. The code of excellence assures the customer of the commitment we bring to the project. In the code of excellence class, it tells you A for A, you know, work safely, watch out for your brother. And uh, pretty much everybody's been out here coordinating with each other, take care of each other. Well, knowing that our 58 brothers and sisters have code of excellence, it makes us walk around to be proud of who we are. And I think it will show like a level of, of integrity and respect towards the other trades so that they will step up, you know, as well as be as professional as we. So far it's been a great success, not only for us, but we also got the entire building trades to implement their version of the code of excellence on this job as well. At the IBEW International is one of the pioneers of the Code of Excellence, and since then, a lot of other internationals have adopted that. This is a unique project, but the Code of Excellence isn't unique to our life and our culture. We want to guarantee to that owner, to that taxpayer, that when our people are on the job, that agreement that we have with our contractors is that that owner uh, can expect the best out of, out of our people. Feedback's been very positive and the client just loves the idea that uh, not only are we saying what we do, we're backing it up. 
The code of excellence reflects the pride that the Powering America team brings to each and every project. But with the District Detroit, it's also reflective of Detroit's return to excellence on a larger scale. I actually get to put my thumbprint somewhere in the city. Years from now, I could point and say, hey, I did that. I did that. Oh, I did that over there too. And that was also me. You know, it's, it's pretty exciting. We've got our arena that is going to house, you know, two of our sports teams. So it's a part of the whole, this is Detroit. You know, people always say the rebirth, but we've always had that hope, we've had that fire, and this is just putting, a, I guess, a spark to that flame and, and just making it bigger. That's all for this edition. Be sure to check us out on Facebook and Twitter for behind the scenes extras and industry information. Until next time, I'm Dominic Giratano. So long.